Hey friends, welcome to Nikra's Expert Learning. In today's video, we are going to find out how to find the determinant of a given matrix using scientific calculator. So in this, I am solving three examples, one of a, uh, each kind. And uh, coming to the first one, we are solving a two by two matrix. That is, uh, first let me explain you what is the order of the matrix. Okay, first uh, order of the matrix is nothing but m by n is represented as m by n. That is. M is number of rows and N is number of columns. So in the previous video also I have explained you what is the uh, order of the matrix regarding the matrix addition. If you haven't watched that video, please go check the video in the description link. I have been link have been provided. So coming to the today's topic, let us see how to find out the determinant of the given matrix using scientific calculator. So first of all, let us solve a two by two matrix. So two by two because uh, I told you the order is nothing but m by n number of rows and number of columns. So in this the number of rows that is horizontal uh, lines are two. So it's going to be two, and by number of columns. So vertically how many lines we are having? We are having two well. Okay. So coming to this we are having three by three. Okay, three rows and three columns. It's going to be three by three matrix. Okay. And again it's going to be a three by three matrix too. Okay, first of all, let us solve this element, this matrix. So here, parallelly, I'll be showing up this question, also the answer, how to get that. So in this, first of all, before solving any matrix, we have to first clear the data in this calculator. Okay, we will be clearing it by pressing Shift Nine. See here, we are having CLR, that is clear option. Click on Nine. Okay. So whatever the yellow elements are there, to get that, we have to press Shift. But whatever the red elements, the B, C, D, here we have to be pressing alpha. Okay. First of all, let us enter shift nine. After that, we will be getting the screen. So here we are clearing all the data in this. Okay. By entering the number three and press is equal to click on A C. To start entering the elements after clearing the data of the calci, first enter mode. Okay. Once you click on this mode, you will be given this uh, screen. Okay. So in this, we are having matrix as sixth number. So whenever a number is given against a term, press that number to get that term. Okay. So first of all, to select the matrix, we have to enter number six over here. And again, first of all, we are entering the matrix one. So click on number one over here. So I have entered the number one. After this, it will be asking us the order of the matrix. We know the order of matrix is two by two. So here the two by two is given in the fifth um, option. Click on number five. So start entering the numbers. Two is equal. So after entering each element, you have to be uh, clicking on this. Okay, click on this is equal to to uh, enter the next element. So after pressing number two, after click on is equal to. After entering one, click is equal to five, four. So even after entering the last element, click on this. Don't forget to click. Okay. After entering this, click on AC. This one. Okay. So first of all, entering has been done. So to determine the determinant of that matrix, click on Shift and click on the number four. Here we are having matrix option. Click on four. Okay. You would be asked to select one from this. So we have to find out the determinant. Determinant is given in the seventh option. Okay, so click on number seven. Determinant of matrix A. So shift again. Go to the four. Click on the third matrix. So we have entered the details in the matrix A. That is third one. Click on the third element. Again, close the bracket and press is equal to to solve. So the determinant of this matrix is three. So this is the answer for this question, guys. So let me also solve this second question for you. Okay. Again, whenever we are starting to enter the details of a certain matrix in the calculator, we have to clear the data. That is by pressing Shift Nine is equal three to select all. Again, we have to press on is equal to. That is given over here. Again, A C. Okay. So after this, we are starting to enter enter these terms. So for this we have to click on mode. Matrix is given in the sixth option. Click on six. Again we have to select the first matrix. This is a three by three matrix. See, this is a three by three matrix. So click on number one. Okay. So start entering the terms, guys. One is equal to two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, and nine. So remember, whenever you have en- uh, started entering these numbers, after each number you have to press this is equal to over here. Even after entering the last number, you have to click this. Okay. Once you have clicked on this, after that you have to press AC. Then the screen will go blank again. Then you have to click on Shift four to get the matrix terms. Again, determinant. Determinant of what? Determinant of the matrix we have just entered. So that is number three to get the matrix A. Close the bracket. Don't forget to close. Click on is equals to. So the order of the determinant of this matrix is going to be zero. Okay, the answer would be zero. That is it for this video, guys. But I will also be giving you the example sum for you to solve. And let me know the answer in the description below, guys. Any other queries regarding this matrix uh, matrix solving, you can just post it down in the comment section below. Any changes you would like me to make uh, regarding this video, you please let me know in the comment section below, guys. If you like this video, please like, share, and comment this channel. And if you don't like, please let me know why you're not liking this video. Because I can just make some improvements to make you guys like this video. Okay. That is it for this video, guys. If you like this video, please like, share, and comment the channel. And please don't forget to find out this answer and post it down in the comment section below. Thank you for watching this video, guys. I appreciate you watching this video. Thank you.